Fine. I don't. So BFP going to be bringing out the Luigi, specifically the purple Luigi, the main. I've been watching a lot of Survivor lately, and Carl's face mask gives Survivor vibes. How oh, does it? Okay. Man, I need to rewatch like Survivor at some point. The buffs that they wear. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, gonna come out with the classic booty cheeks tag. <laughs> we'll see how they. They're probably gonna take their time here in neutral at the start. They're none of them wants to get caught up in the other's nonsense. Yeah, just trying to wall out here with the uh, the fireball is gonna use a lot of like really quick moves to try to keep Carl's out. But once he has that speed monado on. It's going to be really hard to keep him out. He's going to be using a lot of Nair to get these combos started. And on a small stage like Smashville, there's not a lot of places to go. Yeah, it just has that down tilt as a, you know, two-frame option. Very nice. Can just repeatedly throw that out like a SF6 jab. Right. Have to be careful with this um, Buster Monado because it racks up a lot of damage, which can be really scary. But we're back on speed. Going to have... A this can be a really scary situation if you're off stage, though, because Carl's is known for just going out there and sharking with forward air. You seem that you like feel that you're safe because he's not on smash art, but it can still be a really scary situation. Yeah, and with jump art, he can go anywhere he wants off that stage. So everything is covered as he's. Oh no, that's bad news because he's dead. Oh, that stinks. Yeah, misfire is. Uh, I feel like more often than not, you just don't want it to actually happen because oftentimes you're just using that side B to recover. Okay, but the times that it hits, it's super cool. Yeah, so. it's great. It, it makes the best Twitter clips. Just ask oh, BFP. Yeah. Knows all about it. He has he has the whole series going for it. Yeah, playing super patient here, waiting for Carl's to mess up so that he can get a whiff punish, but not even messing up there, just able to catch the roll back onto stage with the down B and pretty even game so far. Yeah, down B in that situation does cover a lot of options. So hard to get away from. You just have to predict that it's going to be coming out. Yeah, and especially in like a lot of um, high percent situations, if you're going for combos, which Shulk does a lot of the time, it can be uh, very scary because if you're not airtight on your combos, he's able to use that down B out of them and can kill, kill you off the top pretty early. So I have to be super careful with that. Yeah, for some reason, they decided to give that move invincibility, and it is pretty wild. All right, getting in with the backwards up there. I like that. That is very good for setting up into future hits, but he doesn't actually get anything in that string. I think that Smashville makes a lot of sense for um, Carl's here because if he's able to use that up at his shield, then um, if he whiffs it or even if he does hit it, he's able to land on that platform rather than being in free fall and going back to the, the stage floor. So, yeah, oh, I also, thought he was going to pull the trigger. Oh, okay, able to get back. He's fine. I was going to say, up tilt, very good at covering that whole platform from Shulk. Like, that, that is a good up tilt to deal with uh, people just sitting on that platform. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and fair in there, too. I feel like he has so many hitboxes that are so good at covering that space. Yeah, definitely. Luigi, I mean, BFP is just going to have to really pick and choose when he comes in. He's pretty good at conditioning his opponent, and he's going to have to take full advantage in order to make, you know, Carl's actually get hit by uh, any of this Luigi stuff. Right, trying to get some extra credit here. Able to wait out that down B. Not going to get a huge punish on it just yet, but going to go off stage. This can be scary for BFP. Okay, yeah, Carl's is showing that he's not afraid to go out there. A lot of the time you'll see Shulk do like a reverse up B to send him back into the blast zone. Oh, that's dangerous. I can't believe he didn't get hit, but the quick sh tri uh, switch to shield art, good awareness of the situation, still surviving. Oh, jump actually a little awkward there, making him fall out of that up B. Okay, yeah, I'm going to see a dash attack, but in jump art, so it's not going to have a ton of knockback. Got to be really careful here. Careful here. We see a lot of, um, yeah. Okay, yeah, it just does it. Like Sometimes F you just do it. Like, Shul um, like Sephiroth that we saw earlier in the match, they love to use that F tilt to kind of swing at the ledge. So saw that there with the conditioning, but able to catch um, the get up with F smash instead, which is not a move that you see super often, I feel like. Yeah, pretty much when you know it's going to hit is the only time it comes out. Like out of, I think, like Buster Monado, early percent down throw combos, you can throw True. it out. True, yeah, yeah, yeah. But most of the time, you're just kind of keeping that in the pocket. That hurts. I hate getting hit by that. Oh, yeah. I want to sue Shad for every time he's hit me with that. <laughs> uh, yeah, but it's, it's sad not to see uh, Shad come out anymore to, to events. But He's got a big kid job. Gotcha. He's living it up. Anyway, Carl's is now our Ohio Shulk representative, and he's, he's been doing quite well. He did really well at cost. Always outplaces his seed in cost. That's just a constant with Shulk. <laughs> uh, not with Shulk, with Carl's. 
And they need to see them first so it can't happen again. <laughs> exactly. Oh my god, we were talking oh about how that gosh. feels, and that does not feel good for BFP no. right now. Big air dodge read, and that is a early kill. BFP answering back pretty well here. A nice little Luigi combo. You know, as he has tons of those on deck. Oh yeah, having a shorter top blast zone here, I think that this counter pick makes a lot of sense for BFP. Gonna see like a lot of up smash, um, which is super strong for Luigi. Gonna see a lot of um, the down B as well. And even if there's a case where Shulk does something super punishable, you might even see a, an up B kill, which can kill super early, but... Oh. Back throw, getting that positioning, but jump art just means he goes right back to wherever he wants to be. Up smash, that is enough. Bro breaks his neck when he does that up smash. <laughs> Listen, he does he does those crazy exercises like that Zangief exercise where you just kind of like hop around on your neck. He's got Bro. that thing strong. <laughs> oh. Okay, big damage here. Able to tie it up, even though it looks like Carl's was in a pretty demanding lead so far. Okay, and this can be really scary. BFP definitely like sharking for a grab here. All right. Knocks him out again. Chomp going to get him right in center, but similarly, he just gets punished with an up smash. Oh, all the way out there. He should be dead. Oh, okay, okay. Not quite enough to kill. Does okay. still have his jump. Very smart. That's so scary. When <laughs> you're at the ledge against Shulk when he's in that smash art, you kind of have to wait for him to throw out a move first and then pick your option. Because if he's just able to throw out hitboxes, it's so hard to contest against him. But yeah, able to he either use, decides yeah. to cover jump and neutral get up with fair, or just cover roll and neutral get up with back air. And it's scary either way. Or he can just sit there and F tilt too. He True. can kind of do whatever he wants. Or they they love to do the up smash. That will oh, come yeah. out at least like But two if you times. get hit by that one, there's like a very correct option for that. So that's on you. Yeah, it's kind of on you. Yeah. That's not just, just Shulk being scary. Attack, it's also show able to do some nonsense. Uh, Girl, what are you uh, doing? Uh, just get up and take it. Uh, this is what it I'm has to happen. About. I mean, it's 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 in the contract. It's in Carl's contract. You have to let it happen at least like once in the set. <laughs> and he was running out of opportunity, so it had to be right there. It had and to be that one. Carl's Getting the up smash for the kill. Well done. BFP, I'm sorry for preemptively calling you an idiot, but just so you know, if you watch back the bot, you can yeah. get up attack that. He did avoid it the first time, though, and that was pretty he good. He did. Yeah, he yeah. did. That was like a perfectly spaced, like up, uh, down B, got back in, hit him off the stage. That He's second like, time, not so much. I'm going to get Emma canceled. I just heard her <laughs> say if you get stand up into to up smash, then you're an idiot. Yeah, she excuse just me, me but I'm very smart, street. actually actually a very in intelligent individual. I would believe it. BFP definitely strikes me as somebody who's very intellectual. He is. Smart guy, smart player. Uh, shame he only plays Luigi, you know? One day he'll